Hey guys, what is up? It is Friendly Neighborhood Uber Goose back, finally, with another commentary. This one is actually a little different than most because it's not about the gameplay at all. In fact, I fail quite a bit, and there's also some points where it is um, very slow paced. And uh, I think there's actually a point where I paused the game to do something, I don't remember. Um, but um, tell me if you guys prefer this, because I've actually, I'm recording in a demo. Like, I'm using the demo recording built into Team Fortress 2. And I'm... Sorry. And from there, uh, I will play back the demo with Wii game. So I don't lag while I play the game. The demo might be a little laggy, though, at times. There are a few points I know of specifically that lag. I changed class pretty crazily, I don't know why. Um, but as you can probably hear, and he might be talking over me depending on where I put the volume, the guy, the guy, this is the second installment to that funny guy from the first one. Uh, and um, pretty much, he, he just like, I don't know what's up with him. And he's probably watching this right now, so hi, whoever you are. And he's just, like, bizarre. He read off... What got my attention was that he was just, like, reading off everything everybody typed. And I think he already did it. I asked, like, do you read everything we type? And he's like, do you read everything we type? Yes! <laughs> so, you know, right there we caused some lag that might actually desync the audio. Maybe? Is that lag? I can't even tell. No, it's not. Okay. But, um, alright, so a few little updates. Uh, I haven't made a video, or at least not a commentary in a while, because I've been pretty busy. Um, because this right now, uh, the day I'm recording is the last Monday of school. We've just got this week to prepare for finals, and then next week we have Monday off, and then we've got... Wednesday, Thursday, Friday for finals, and then school is over for the year. So, <laughs> I've, I've just, it's been pretty crazy um, trying to catch up on work that I've missed and stuff. But, uh, after, after finals are over, I'll probably post more frequently. So, don't worry about that. And... I've just got a few questions, like, do you guys like the speed art thing, and do you guys want more, like, short videos, like, uh, the mini, or, like, the montage I made of Toby Soda Lemon stuff, oh, Speed Hacker, so, yeah, do you guys like that short stuff, do you guys like the speed art, or do you guys prefer, like, a full-length 10-minute commentary, and also, if you choose commentary, would you guys prefer tactics, or, like, just, do you guys want tactics, do you guys want, like, specific stats, like, how much damage, sorry about the movie, uh, how much damage a weapon would do, or something, something like that, um, or would you guys just prefer entertaining gameplay, cause I can do pretty much any of that, um, I I might have said in previous commentaries, I've had this game for two years, I want to say, yeah, two, two years, um, it came out, when did this game came out, come out, like 2007, in like two years, maybe two and a half years, I don't know, something like that, that's how long I've had this game, so I've been with it since before they even doing, it started doing class updates, oh, and that's right there, sorry, um, that, that right there is a, problem with the demo recording that I've been finding. Like, sometimes uh, the scenery won't move well. Like, it won't move with the character sometimes when playing back for some apparent reason. I don't know why. Um, I might have to find out a way to sort that out or just start recording the actual game again. But, whatever. Um... Yeah, so I've been I've been playing this game since before the class update started, which was actually that was a better time, 
Because nobody would spy check except Pyros, because nobody really could effectively spy check except for Pyros. Now, scouts have a knockback. Uh, I actually am not sure if that works on guys who are disguised. I had never, ever used the force of nature anyway. Um, I know rockets don't knock them back, so I don't think it does, but, um, anyway, uh, also, yeah, heavies have a spy check, Natasha, uh, medics have two spy checks, that's ridiculous, then snipers have a spy check, the Jurati, and they've got the anti-spy shield called the Razorback, they... Every, pretty much every class can counter a spy now, except for engineer. But I'm sure, I'm sure Valve will give them some anti-spy thing or something. What I really wanted Valve to do, though, for the spy update was give. I mean, the the different watches is a pretty cool idea. Different revolver was kind of necessary, even though I don't like the ambassador. But um, lost my train of thought. Oh, right. They needed... I thought they needed to add a flame-proof suit. Like, you'd... It'd be kind of like, currently, like, pyro on pyro. How near them sets on fire, but they both take damage. That sort of thing. Like, where the fire won't... won't... You won't set on fire, but you'll still take damage from the flames. And also, I would love it if it made no noise, too. <laughs> That's just kind of ridiculous how easy it is to spy check. Or if they gave spies who are disguised extra health, or just increase the health of a spy in general. Although that could be slightly game breaking, because then they could pretty much, with a medic, a spy could just run around and like face stab people, which will never be patched because it's impossible to patch due to lag. But whatever. I don't know what happened there. I must have stopped recording or something and then re started recording again. I don't know. I don't know what happened. But, um, I don't think you missed anything. At some point in the game, that, that guy who was in the last video, the funny guy, I'm just going to keep referring him to him as the funny guy, he actually started asking for phone numbers, and people started typing in phone numbers in the chat. And stuff like I'm pretty sure almost all of them were fake, but it's pretty funny because he like started to call them. And uh, I know one person actually gave him their real phone number, and he actually called him, and the guy actually answered. So it was pretty funny. And uh, don't have much more to talk about. It's actually it's nice to be inside because. Right now, we got an incredibly strong heat wave. It's, I think, 90 degrees outside, with some ridiculous amount of humidity. And that was not fun. Especially because our school, for n no apparent reason, the AC doesn't work. <laughs> like, it, it, it'll work, but not correctly. It'll, like, eventually start circulating the hot air. Which is not fun, because then that just leads to very hot classrooms. And, yeah, there's like a minute some left. Um, I've got some Call of Duty 4 gameplay. It's not really, it's not anything. Um, like, any Call of Duty 4 gameplay on PC, is, from me at least, this is generally not going to be like what you'd expect from a Call of Duty gameplay, because PC can have up to 64 people in a game at once. So it leaves a pretty hectic moments, including a, a seven-man spray I got on shipment, followed by like a plus 200 airstrike, and unfortunately I wasn't recording at that time. I did get a crazy spray and crazy airstrike on shipment recorded, but it wasn't the plus 200 one. But, um... Yeah. So I've, I've got some Call of Duty 4 stuff I can upload. It's pretty crazy. There's no techniques involved. It's just entertaining. And, yeah, you really... 
that right there that just happened was kind of crazy. And actually, I, li I like that situation a lot. How, like, all of a sudden, all of the enemies are just, like, there. <laughs> just sitting on the point. Like, we'll hold it, guys. Just stay put. Um, yeah. yeah, the video is almost over. I don't know how much time. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. There's going to be another one of these videos up uh, in the next few days. It's going to be the next in this series. So, look out for that, and that's it. See you guys.